everybody, this is Tina with Loving Life's Little Blessing. And look at all the fun products. So I have my annual catalog first um, order reveal and I am going to go ahead and put you up top here and I'm going to show you all of the items that I got but I just thought I would give you um, this view really quick because I got a lot of kits and stuff for an upcoming club that I'll be doing. So I thought I would go ahead and give you this. All right, let's dive in and I'll show you what I got. Um, let's start with the stamp set so then I can move those and then we can um, look at the other stuff. So I always get a pretty good amount of stamp sets. It's usually the biggest chunk of stamp sets I get um, out of the annual catalog. And so let's just start off. I got this one. This is the Circle of Spring and it actually goes with framelits that we had already um ha that we already have the wonderful wreath framelits which coordinated with christmas items and it carried over to the new catalog and i did not i had not got this framelit set because i didn't get the stamp set in the holiday catalog so this actually coordinates with that this uh, framelit set so i got that one this one is not a new one. We've had it in the catalog for a while, but I really um, love this one. And so I went ahead and got it. I've seen a lot of really fun things for Christmas with this particular stamp. This is my favorite sentiment stamp out of the new catalog. It is Happy Happenings, and I just love it. I love all of the fonts, and then I love the sayings. I think it's really, really beautiful. So then we have this one, which is One Big Meaning. And I love having an all around thank you, you know, sentiment set. So that was perfect. This I'll show you in a minute. I went ahead and got this one right away. I love it. I love the sentiments the most. The sky's the limits. Good luck. You are my sunshine. This is going to be great for so many different things. And all of these little items are going to be perfect. I got the this one, Your Sublime. I thought it would be great for watercoloring, which I'm trying to do more of. So I thought that'd be great. I got this one, Made with Love. I actually have a friend that's having a baby, and this set coordinates with the uh, framelits I already have that came out last year. And she's having a baby, and I got the Baby Project Life Kit, and I thought that this would be a great addition to doing some fun stuff for her. So I got that one. Me equals grateful. I love this. I love this. I love this. I love the sentiments, the fonts. Um, it's just beautiful, and I really, really, really love this one. So then I made a mistake, and I got this in wood mount. I cannot believe that I did that, um, but that's what happens when you stay up till 1 o'clock in the morning to put in your order. So I got this in wood mount, but I have some clear mount stuff that I'll just make this into clear mount stamps. I won't use the wood blocks, but I got this um, for a kit that I am going to be doing a club with. So those were my first set of stamp sets. And then I have two other stamp sets here that go with Project Life kits. So I got the bundle and I got the accessory kit and the stamp set. This is the Happy Times. And I went ahead and picked up the accessory kit, the card kit, and then the stamp set. And I'll be going over these specifically on a Project Life by Stampin' Up! Tuesday. So, but I got the bundle and got both of these. This is going to be one of my favorite stamp sets to use with um, Project Life. I'm going to love it. And then, as I mentioned, I did pick up the Baby Boy Project Life kit and I did the accessory kit again. I picked up the kit and the stamp set and then the accessory kit all together as a bundle to save a little bit of money. So I did get both of those. So now I, this is one of the framelits I got, but then I did get quite a chunk of dies. So I got the Baker's Box. This is the tags. And I wasn't sure about this. I think I'm going to like this. I'm not sure about these. But I was on the fence, and at the very last minute, I put it on my order. These are not new, but I did pick them up because I'm going to be using them with Project Life. And this is the file tabs. And so these, we've had these out for a year and they've been on my list. They're only $11. And so I just went ahead and threw them on. And then I also got the Project Life, the new Project Life. Then let's, these are going to be so fun. They coordinate with the Project Life 
um, stamp sets. There's a couple images on my other stamp set, not this, not this one. Okay, it's on my other one that coordinate with some of these. So that's going to be fun. I always love when the framelits coordinate with different things. Makes it really easy. So I got those. So the next thing, um, let's look at the punches. I always get the punches right away. I love the punches, which is kind of crazy because when I first started stamping up, I didn't like our punches. I mean, I was like, who wants to spend all the time punching when I have a die cut machine and I can just die cut all my stuff but I actually fell in love with punches it took me about a year and a half to build up my collection um, of them and I love them they're great they're super simple to just grab I just think they're great a great addition so we have the washi tape label we have the little star which you guys know I'm crazy about anything with stars so I'm definitely going to be using this and then I love that we've added a one and a half inch circle to our circle lineup I think that's perfect I use my circle punches the most so I think that's great so let me show you the accessories I got I got the in color washi tape I love that they did a set of washi tape in our end colors from last year because I'm always looking for things that coordinate really well like that. Like our end colors, I tend to use a great deal because I just know these five colors are going to go great or these three colors will go great from that lineup. So I love that they did that and I grabbed those. I love the black and white washi tape. I actually got several sets of these. Um, I love the sequence. This is black and white and gold sequence. I love that. I love this gold and silver. It's like this really thin thread type. It's thinner than our linen thread. I don't even know where it starts. Oh, it's taped, but it's super thin. I mean, it's just gorgeous. And I think it being in silver and gold are gonna be perfect. I got the sweet little thing washi tape. I always get all the washi tape just so I can have it, see it, look at it. I think this washi tape is really pretty. I love this. I think this is very neutral. So I did that. I wanted to try these out and I was super glad I did. So these are the metal rimmed pearls. And they already have adhesive on the back. So how perfect and easy is that? I will definitely be getting more of these. They are a little bit thicker uh, than I had originally thought. So let me see if I can pick one up. So they have some real depth to them. I was surprised about that. So those are beautiful. So the other thing I got was the, these uh, beautiful buttons. Now this is two full containers of buttons. Uh, there's like 24 when you get them, but they're in a very vanilla color. And I got two containers of them because I know I'll go through them pretty quick. I picked up some more Watermelon Wonder ribbon, and that's for my paper share. So I can wrap everything up real pretty. I got these bags. This is also for my paper share. I always include a little extra goodie, and I'll be including one of these bags with sequins and it'll be wrapped up in some beautiful ribbon but these are beautiful they're so fun it's going to be amazing to do things with these so i picked up two bags of those and then let's move this whole pile over here so this is where the majority of the stuff really i thought i really got i got this kit this is the birthday uh, kit and I am going to be starting a club in July. It's going to be 30, $35 a month. You just buy $35 in product and then you get access to watch me create a project and then if you want to get the items to make what I'm making you can. All of the items that I'll be putting together are $35, so it makes it really simple. But this is one of the kits that I'm gonna be featuring. I'm actually gonna show a different way. Instead of putting it on a clipboard, I'm gonna show you how to um, bind it and actually make it a little book. So I got this kit, and then it, can, it has a stamp set that coordinates. So that's perfect. I picked that up. I picked up the, this is the uh, Baker's Box Treat Kit, and this is again for one of the clubs that I'm doing one of the months, I'll be featuring this, and that is, it coordinates with that other stamp set. 
this one right here. So I have this. That's going to be one. I did get some more uh, Project Life page protectors. We have a new design, a new variety pack, and I went ahead and picked up that. This is the... What is this one called? Hello Life Kit. And we're, I'm actually going to be featuring this in one of my clubs, and we're actually going to be making cards out of all of this beautiful product. So I have this, and then I have the note cards, and that's what we'll be doing for that month for the club. So then I got paper, of course. So I always get one of all the new papers for myself right away just so that I have them, I can create with them, I can see how they look, um, see if I like them, and then that is how I decide if I want to get more. So we have the Bohemian. Wouldn't you know, I just paper cut myself and I opened all of this just like that with my nail and did not paper cut myself. I'm going to go put a band-aid on and I'll be right back. I know, Peggy always says, comments and says, don't open paper like that, you're gonna get a paper cut. That's okay, so I already showed you guys the Bohemian paper because I, I had gotten, because I had gotten some during my pre-order. This paper right here is gorgeous. I guess I didn't open this one. I thought I had, I thought I opened all of them. This one is gorgeous, I had seen this paper um, before and you guys, it is, I'm gonna zoom in to show you guys the paper. It is amazing. You cannot even tell in the catalog that this is how gorgeous this paper is, and especially this. I know you guys have probably seen people coloring these roses and really making them pop. Wendy did a video on that, and that is really gorgeous and creative. This is the Farmer's Market. I think I'm going to do my Project Life, my September Project Life with this paper. At first, I was not crazy about it. I was like, uh, but this really sold me. This one, this one, and then this one. So I'm gonna wait and see what, what paper comes out in our holiday catalog, but this might be my Project Life uh, fall paper. Then we have this paper. I'm not crazy about this paper, you guys. I'll probably never buy another set of this paper. <laughs> Uh, it's just not my thing. The only thing I like on it are the bees. You guys know I'm just not really big into the, the floral stuff. I didn't get the floral stuff in our occasions. I just, I'm not crazy about it. I'll just be honest. Then there's the school uh, paper. I'm not sure all the names of this, but I love this. I love this. It'll be great for the kids when they go back to school. That's probably when I'll be using it the most. Perfect. Here's the Christmas paper that is in the holiday or in the um, occasions holiday. I'm going crazy. Um, in the annual catalog. I like it. I'm not crazy about it. I hope we have something a little bit more Christmassy in the holiday catalog. But I mean, it's a good, it's a good solid Christmas paper. It has the polka dots, the stripes, you know, I mean, it's, it's good basic Christmas paper. Nothing to complain about. This is the sweet little thing paper, which I think is cute for summer um, and spring. I, it would be great for baby too, but I think it's, it's great for summer and spring. So I love that. I love the colors. It matches this washi tape. This is the Everyday Chic, which I love that we have a basic black paper. We usually always do. The last few years we have had a basic black kind of set. And this is by far my favorite. I think it has great trendy designs. Then of course I got the stacks. Um, this is the newly designed stacks. I think these are great. I use them all the time. This is the new in color set. This is uh, last year's in color set. This is the Settles. This is the Brights. And then I have on order the Regals, the Neutrals. And then I also have the Cutie Pie die and the number 
the number dies as well. Those are just on a different order and they're coming, but I just wanted to show you what I mainly got. And then I, all next week, you're gonna start seeing projects with all of the stuff, all of the amazing paper, all of the amazing punches, all the amazing stamp sets. I'm really gonna dive in and start creating and get things, um, get fun things up for you guys. So I will talk to you, of course, tomorrow, and I'll be back on Friday for Memory Keeping Friday. So thanks guys for checking out all of the goodies that I got. I will talk to you later. Mm -hmm.